Ken, how are you today? I'm, I'm doing great, uh, Kevin. <laughs> You're looking good. Thank you. And speaking of looking good, we are doing a very, very critical show today, and that is on celebrity coffees. I knew you'd be excited about this concept, Ken. Yeah, yeah, I'm just uh, very excited, actually. I'm excited about any coffee. Uh, that is true. I, Knowing you yeah. as I do, I would agree with that. Me too. Something we have in common. This one is interesting, but I think I was being a little ironic because I'm really not sure what to expect. My concern with anything celebrity, admittedly, I have a George Foreman grill, you know, but anything celebrity, my first thought is, did the celebrity have anything to do with it? Are they just lending their name to something? There's nothing wrong with doing that, but do they really have any part in it at all? And is the product a less or just average or even less than average product that they're trying to just squeeze a lot of money on for the value of the name? We'll find out. Perhaps. Okay. I've got five coffees. You don't know what coffees they are. You might have an inkling because obviously they're celebrity. I promised I would try to get ones people had heard of. So celebrity coffees, not just celebrities in the coffee business. They're celebrities in the rest of the world. And we've got five. Each of us has five, and we will take them one at a time, and then the last thing we'll do is uh, put them in order as to which ones, at least each of our favorites. Can I factor in my favorite celebrity if I like one of the celebrities, or do I have to do it? I guess purely on the coffee, right? (laughs) Okay. Yeah, I'm it, ready. it should be I'm purely ready. in the coffee, and yet, wait, well, but on yet, you know what? I have to admit, I probably I have to watch that in myself because if I like a celebrity, it's part of me that wants to like the coffee more. Yeah, but we'll see. Okay, well, let's uh, get our first coffee. 